It's deja vu for the foundation that announced it was closing the Crotchet Mountain Rehabilitation Center in Greenfield in 2020 because of COVID staffing issues. The Crotchet Mountain Foundation is really saddened to hear about the closure of the legacy by Gersh School. Gersh Autism took over in 2020, buying the school, shifting to working with residents on the autism spectrum from the ages of 4 to 21. Today, owner Kevin Gersh notifying families of its roughly 50 residents that it will close November 18th. Please know we did not come to this decision lightly. Our number one priority is the safety of our students. The truth is we have worked exhaustively to shore up future workforce and keep Crotchet Mountain open, but we simply do not foresee a solution to the staffing shortage that will enable us to continue to provide the level of safety and care they deserve. The state's licensing website, meantime, shows that it conducted 13 complaint investigations this year at Legacy at Gersh, ranging from a lack of background fingerprints on some staff to not meeting staff ratios, to some residents not receiving medications on time, to a resident walking away, and one complaint of a staff member hitting a resident in the head with a closed fist multiple times. We reached out to the facility's owner about these issues and the closure and have not heard back. It really saddens me because I know that the state of New Hampshire doesn't have another facility like this, that there are many families struggling to, to find a placement for their kids. Now the Crotchet Mountain Foundation president says it has offered assistance to Gersh. He says the children that are affected will be provided safety and support while state agencies and school districts work with them on a new placement and a new path. Reporting live, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.